So where's the gold? A lot of people, some people believe that the gold in Fort Knox has disappeared. Um, that's been in question for many years. Congressmen have attempted to get an audit of the gold in Fort Knox. Um, so a million metric tons of gold is not something you can just hide. Where would you say that that gold is being stored? 400,000 metric tons are in the central bank of the Philippines. There's over 200,000 metric tons in Union Bank of Switzerland. And some of that gold is buried securely in the Philippines as well. Some of it is held in various banks, but the bulk of it is in the Philippines. You're now listening to Biggest Palladium Deposits Found in Philippines, the Philippine Pride. Philippines could be one of the richest countries in Asia, following the discovery of the world's biggest palladium reserve off the coasts of Negros, Panay, Mindoro, and Romblon Islands, south of Luzon. NASA, together with USGS, United States Geological Survey, released a three-year study report detailing the 11,450 square kilometer palladium deposits lying below the seas of Asian Cebu. Palladium. Palladium is an important component in electronics and is used in many new technologies such as fuel cells. As a commodity, it's drawn the attention of investors because it's not easily substituted and is an important component of catalytic converters. Palladium, platinum, rhodium, ruthenium, iridium and osmium form a group of elements referred to as the platinum group metals. It's a metal used in many types of manufacturing processes and is found in electronics and industrial products. Scientists made an extraordinary discovery. A new kind of hydrogen. One where the nucleus contained an extra neutron, making it heavier. Scientists called it deuterium. And just like normal hydrogen, deuterium combined with oxygen to make a new kind of water. Heavy water.